Article number 10. Move that the town appropriate $986,000 to pay cost of engineering, permitting, construction, and all other costs associated with the rehabilitation of wastewater pump station one and four for the sewer division, including without limitation all cost thereof, and defined in section one of chapter 29C of general laws, as most recently amended by statute 1998, chapter 78 that to meet the appropriation, the treasurer, with the approval of the select board, is authorized to borrow $986,000 and issue bonds or notes thereof under Chapter 44, Section 7, parentheses 1, and or Chapter 29C of the General Laws, and most recently amended by Statute 1998, Chapter 78. That such bonds or notes shall be general obligations of the town unless the treasurer, with the approval of the select board, determines that they should be issued as limited obligations and may be secured by local system revenues as defined in chapter one, I'm sorry, in section one of chapter 29C, as most recently amended by statute 1998 CC 78, that the sewer commission is authorized to expend all funds available for the project and shall take any other options necessary to carry out the project. Is there a motion? Is there a second? Second. Motion in second. And select board recommends four approval, one abstention. Finance committee recommends three for the issue. Capital planning recommends five, zero. Selectman Mooring. Hello again. So, I apologize. I have to take my glasses off to read my notes. So you can make faces at me because I can't see what you're doing now. So we're now ready for the construction phase of wastewater pump station one and four. Um, pump station one is on Bay Road and Middle Street and it was built in 1964 and was rebuilt in 1988. Number four was, is on the corner of uh, West Street and Bay Road and was built in 1964 and has had no major upgrades at this time. The current article before you borrows for the construction costs and uses wastewater rate money to pay back the loan, not taxpayer money. The major upgrades include Installation of new pumps at each station, which also are more efficient. Um, relocation of critical electrical systems to avoid potential flooding and damage, and new piping and valves. Uh, again, this is going to be uh, funded through the sewer receipts, and there's no impact on taxes. Uh, the good part about this is, is that the 2008 price tag for this project was 1.46 million. We now are down to 900,000 and change. Please vote for it, thank you. $86,000 is change? Yeah. <laughs> Any discussion? Yeah, it's always discussion. Seeing none, I'd like to call for a vote. All those in favor, in favor, please signify by raising your cards. All those opposed? Article number 11, it is unanimous, I'm sorry. 